It gets you right here. Right here. Get to here. Gets you right. It gets you right here. Right. Get to here. Gets you right here. Welcome to the Hunts Report. And today I am testing out a super tall, super tall tripod over here. If you're wondering how I get up here, it's a stool. You need one. Why do I have a super tall tripod? Well, it's to get over the head of the average man or woman. Six feet tall, you clear 95% of most heads. So you can get in the back of a venue, get a nice telephoto zoom, just like this here, and get some beautiful shots from a different angle. A focus peaking on, because of the Sony cameras, or with an Atomos video recorder, which also provides focus peaking, and you're really in business. So as long as you hold steady, and you just breathe and use the force, you're gonna get some great videos. Look at that nice fluid motion. There's my window fan down to the air conditioner up. And I would call this just a really nice fluid motion. It's great for weddings, it's great for parties, for bands, and it's just a great uh, tool to have, especially considering it costs only about $200. Now these are tripod legs. You're gonna have to get the video head separately. This is a fluid drag head by Cowboy Studio. Check the description below for where to get all these products on amazon.com. Now let me walk you through some of the pros and cons. Some of the pros, it's really cheap. There are much more expensive tripods, almost triple to double the price of this. Another great thing is the height. This isn't even at maximum height. Let me show you how tall it really, really, oh my goodness, goes. Literally, okay, we're talking like, you're gonna clear basketball players all the way up here. So that's gonna be super good. Let's bring it back down. If your camera has a nice little flip display here, just flip it on down, and then it can even be over your head. Get your fluid drag arm nice and long. Maybe the one con is that it's not 100% mega sturdy, but as long as you're gonna put one hand right here with the fluid drag head, you're gonna be good to go. And if you have optical stabilization in your lens or on a camera like the Sony a7 II, which has built in optical stabilization, and this is a legacy Nikon F2.8 70 to 200 lens, the ultimate lens for low light and zoom. So the first thing that is super, super good about this is that it has flip lock legs. Twist lock legs tend to come out and it can make you just look like a moron and it slows you down, especially if you have a limited amount of time to set up. So this is one of the huge selling points for me on this tripod. So this is the Cowboy Studio fluid drag head. Really, really good bang for the buck, under $100. Extremely good build quality. And uh, I'm gonna tighten up the bolt here. Boom, comes off. Right off. So you could put any, any head, standard 5 8 inch tripod head slot. So you got these great flip locks. You have these height indicators. Here's, here's the bottom of the, of the tripods. It's actually this uh, interesting shape which saves space. And this is one of the thinnest tripods. The weight is great on this baby. Y-tube column by Geodos. You can just go and go ultra wide on the stance for extra, extra stability. Super lightweight given what it does. You know, this is going to be your go-to for the $200 price point. If you can afford something in the $400 to $1,000 price point, there's a few items from Manfrotto in the description below. This is the Hunter Report. Please subscribe. Please give me a thumbs up and I'll see you soon.